Your action just made me want to do it even more. <laughs> I'm sure they have some kind of adapter for it. I look at the camera. Two, two, three. So I want you to, I want you to move your head. Yeah, but it was completely worth it. I don't care if they. Oh, oh yeah, yeah. They didn't figure it out. I figured it out because I was like, wait. You know what? You have an LG phone. Okay, try that. I really use it. Did no one see that? See what? Smile. That's good. That's good. I can tell you that UG could have done it too. Time. Okay, he's gonna watch. All right, here we go. This is uh, this is you know tight close. So thirty seconds. Thirty seconds. Okay, got it. Or less. <laughs> close. Take two. People say, so how can we work together? Very simple. Let's set up an exploratory call. Usually 30, 45 minutes. I'll understand you. I'll, based upon that, I'll look to see if I can propose something to you that makes sense based on how we've succeeded with others. And if there's a basis to go forward, I'll offer you a proposal. If, if you think it's win-win, then we can turn on the switch and get to work. Nailed it. Very good. Very good. Let's do one more. Okay. Another close. Now, that was perfect. I just want to do it. I want to do one more introduction of yourself. One more close. Okay. So which one are we doing first? Close. Okay. One, two, three. People ask us, this is intriguing, how can we work together? The best way to do that is for us to set up a time to talk about that specifically. So I want to learn about you, what you're looking to accomplish based upon where you are. And then I'll make a proposal of a couple of ideas, if it makes sense. <coughs> it's okay. Take it deep. Start again. <coughs> Just yeah, that's why I got your water. Oh, you put that there for me? I did. I didn't know that. Okay. Yeah. All right, here we go. This is uh, Don, close, take three. At this point in our conversation, people often ask how That had a lot of books and stuff. Uh, oh, oh, you're talking about Brendan Burchard. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, oh yeah, he does that because he like, kind of gives us behind the curtain type of feel. Yeah, yeah, exactly. Yeah, so, yeah. so I want to have a little bit of that. Okay. Yes, me too. Me too. Thank you. There's no surprise that it isn't, so we better do that. Yeah, go, let's go airplane mode. All right, so you don't have to worry too much about me. I'm going to be like moving around. Okay. I want you to talk to the cameras. Everything's rolling. Right. Everything's rolling. I'm just going to give you a cut so I can sync everything up. Uh, so. So everything's already rolling. It's already rolling. Oh, okay, good. So what I do now is I do Don Sardella, take one, and now I can sync them all up with that clap. Okay. And then, uh, so... <clears throat> I'm going for about three minutes here. Oh, we'll go, we'll go with forever. Just say what you need to say. Okay, and got then it. I'm going to direct okay. to go back to points as I see fit. Okay. I had a sheet of paper here. Yeah, did I put it over there? I thought I put it on the app. Um, those are my, my cues. Yeah, where I laid down. Did the, I yeah. write this on the back? Yeah, those are my cues. All right. Good. All right, Don. Here we go. Look at the camera. Three, two. Have you ever wondered if the way you're living and working is the Let's best? Cut. Let's do it again. <laughs> <laughs> it's okay. We're going to slide We're gonna slide right into this. All right, here we go. Three, two. Have you ever wondered if the way you're living and working is the best you can get it? Years ago, I was in a situation, uh, about 30 years ago actually, where I was in this being led by a supervisor, and I wanted, is this the best way to lead people and communicate with people and build trust and create a team and get a project done? There's got to be a better way. And then I talked to some of my colleagues, and I was finding out they were having the same kind of challenging and frustrating experience. My name's Don Sardella. What I do is leadership development coaching and team building. But particularly in the last 25 years, I've done a lot of work in the financial services industry, working with wealth managers and financial advisors and sole entrepreneurs. 
to help them, first of all, look for them what constitutes a great quality of life. You know, a life that they look forward to getting up to in the morning and fully living, being all out, you know, living full out and all in. And then take a look at their business and their, and their practice and see that we have this thing as organized or as streamlined as possible to support you in living the life that you love and that you want. Over that period of time, I've had a chance to work with hundreds of, of, of advisors throughout the United States and entrepreneurs. And during that time period, the kind of results that people report to us, for example, we were in a project about 10 years ago called Project Double. And in Project Double, the idea was to see who was seriously committed to growing and doubling their business in the next two to three years. 50% of the people who participated in that program accomplished that goal, and another 25% went on to double their business again. So they quadrupled their business in a four or five year period. But most importantly, what they celebrated was the fact that they did it in the same amount of time or less, and they were able to spend more time, had more discretionary time, to spend with the people they loved outside of work or interests that they wanted to pursue beyond work. The programs oftentimes, according to our clients that track us, they'll talk about a 28 to 42 percent increase over and above what they're already doing. So if they're doing a 5 or 10 percent increase already, and we're able to add another